Hello, my name is Scott Rogers. I'm the technical marketing manager for Tom's Observability by Wavefront. And today I'm going to show you how to configure the new Open Telemetry Collector Tanzu Observability Exporter so you can get your Open Telemetry trace data into TO. Here we are in the docs for Open Telemetry by Wavefront. And if we scroll down, we can see that today you have to configure a Jaeger or a Zipkin exporter to essentially translate that data into TO. However, with the new Open Telemetry Collector Exporter for Tanzu Observability, this is no longer required. Here we are in GitHub at the Open Telemetry Collector Contrib repo. And to look at the exporter, we simply click on the exporter folder. We scroll down to the Tanzu Observability Exporter. And here we have the README file, which has the prerequisites, the data conversion, some ex and an example configuration uh, to help you get you started. So we're going to use this example configuration and the example code in this repo to show how this works with Tanzu Observability. Here we are again in the Open Telemetry Collector Contrib repo. This time we click on Examples, click on Tracing, and here we see the Open Telemetry team has provided a demo so you can see how it works. In this case, we're going to replace Zipkin with Tanzu Observability and observe that we can send that trace data to TO directly with this new collector exporter. So here we are in our editor, and on the right, we have the collector config YAML that came with the example. And on the left, we've taken that readme file and copied it into our editor, and we've just really named it with an extension dash tanzu.yaml, and we've, re we've configured it so that it will um, work in this environment. So we really just have to make sure the receivers match what we see over here in the example. And then the receiver down here needs to match that. And then of course we change the endpoint to be a wavefront proxy we've already configured to receive traces. At that point we can start the application or the, the example application up by simply typing docker compose up. And once it gets running we can follow the example instructions and simply curl the host where this is running on port 8081. So I'll do that from another window. And when I run that curl command, you'll see the application here respond in this window with a 202 accepted. And after we do this, we wait a few seconds. We can then go over to Tanzu Observability and observe these traces directly in TO. So here we are in Tanzu Observability. We're on the traces screen. You can see we're set to last five minutes, so we can see some of these traces we just ran using the curl command against the demo app, and that data is now available for you in Tanzu Observability. So we can click on uh, the traces or the spans in the trace, and we can see that information that got sent via the open telemetry integration. So let's go back to our editor and see what we did. You know, this time, instead of having to configure a separate Jaeger or Zipkin exporter, we simply configured it, the Tanzu Observability Exporter directly in the Open Telemetry Collector config, and that data gets exported to our Wavefront proxy, which then sends it to TO. This really simplifies the ability to get your Open Telemetry trace data into Tanzu Observability. I hope this video has helped you understand how easy it is to get your Open Telemetry tra trace data into Tanzu Observability using the new. Open Telemetry Collector Exporter for Tons Observability by Wavefront. Thank you for watching.